So it is Valentine's Day. We haven't made a video together in quite some time because stuff and stuff. And um, so we're just doing a quick little Valentine slash other update. So for Valentine's Day, he bought me this beautiful, now empty box of <laughs> chocolate covered strawberries. I'm pretty sure they're hand dipped. I shared a picture on my Instagram and people knew the company already, which is pretty cool. I didn't tell you that. Sherry's people, Berries. Yeah, they were like, oh, Sherry's Berries is the best. So um, I had never heard of them before, but then again, I've only been back in the country for a couple of months. <laughs> but um, they were really good. I, I have pictures of them, of the box and the, the strawberries. So I'll put the pictures there. And he said he got me something else that hasn't come in yet. It didn't come yeah. in in time. Um, and then I got him a couple of things. You can show what I got you. <laughs> You're just like, yep. I got a Zippo lighter with our picture ingrained on it. And a, and a quote. And a quote. It says, Josh and Raven Twin Flames, I will always love you June 10th, 2017. It's a Zippo lighter. And the, uh... You put your hand behind it or something. Yeah. The picture's kind of faded out. But yeah, they didn't I put the picture the, on very yeah. well. Uh, and quite ironically, that he that I got him that because that I got him something else. And he came with this. What it's is like that? A, it's an Eiffel Tower. Oh yeah, like a little charm. It's a charm. It's an Eiffel Tower charm for some reason. I had ordered that in a personalized bracelet, but after I paid for the bracelet, they said, "Oh, sorry, the bracelet's not in stock." So they gave me a refund. And I was looking for something. I was like, what else? And I thought of this, because this one here is a heavy smoker, and I don't want him to die <laughs> with cancer or anything, so I bought him this other thing. It's a jewel. It's a... J-U-U-L. It's like a vape kind of thing, but it's better, I think. It runs on these cartridges. <laughs> it has different flavors. I chose the cool mint. Because that was the smoke menthol. The starter pack comes with cream brulee, fruit melody, Virginia tobacco, and um, cool mint, mint. Cool yeah. mint. And he did not and like the, the tobacco. tobacco was harsh. <laughs> Ugh. But made me sick. I did a lot of research, and this one was really good. It's a, You can charge it with the USB. charges fast, apparently. Oh, yeah, um, like five minutes. It has this little light here. If you tap it, you can see it's almost dead, so it's red. And um, it's an all-in-one, so you just pop it in, and this becomes the mouthpiece. And it's handy, too. So. Yeah, he walking around Walmart, and I just see the little white clouds of smoke, and I'm like, are you serious? <laughs> so it, works, um, it works. It's got 5% nicotine, so it's actually the same as uh, one pod of those is the same as an entire pack of cigarettes. Yeah. So you get a pack of four pods for, like, 16 bucks. So that's like four packs of cigarettes or 16 bucks. So it's pretty good. And uh, he loves it, nah, which is awesome. Nice. I thought that would be a, a nice, not a, a lot of money too. Not a love gift, but a, nah. a, I love you. I don't want you to die gift. Nah. And then we got cards. This is the card he gave me. No. And then this is the, the actual card. My nails look like shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ. My, my nail polish bottle was empty, so I had to kind of scrape it out, and it looks really bad. Oh, so sweet. I love it. That's mine. The actual cord. Beautiful, it really is. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. You're beautiful. That's the inside. I should have words. Yep. It's really nice. Yeah. Love it. So it's our first nice. Valentine's together. Yeah. And we also had some pretty big news. I posted about it on my Facebook page. Um, so for those of you who missed it, Josh will explain. What happened? Mm -hmm. We uh, 
we were in dire need of another vehicle. A vehicle. A vehicle. And uh, we found one for 700 Mm-hmm. 700 and uh i was able to talk him down to five and then all of a sudden an hour or so later he decided to give it to us for free which was pretty amazing it's uh it's not in the best shape but uh it's free it's free and it's kind of minor problems it's a negative battery cable that needs to be replaced i've already bought that but i bought it too long so we'll have to go replace it and uh, there's no air conditioning. Yeah, there's or heat, no AC or heat, but that can be windows. <laughs> and that can be fixed though. Um, inside, it's real cushy. It's real yeah. soft. We had done a video outside the day we got it, but the video had no audio, so I can't use it. But I'll, I took a picture, so I'll put a picture of it here. And then I took a picture of him standing next to it. And while it looks really big, it's a 2005 Jeep Cherokee. 95. Oh, 95. Sorry. When he stands next to it, it looks like a fucking Hot Wheels toy or something because he's so tall. He makes right. it look look itty bitty. Um, so I'll put I'll put the pictures there. But um, I was you talking. Gas and all that. Yeah, so, I was talking nice. to the guy and I was like, "Thank you so <clears throat> much for for holding it for us until we could find a way to get it because it was actually located in Georgia. We're in South Carolina, and he delivered it." Yeah. And um, he had told me, you know, about a year ago, he was talking to his wife and he was saying that when they get a new vehicle, they would actually give that, well, they would give the Jeep to someone in need. And we happened to cross this path then. And he said, you know what, what I'm going to do for you is I'm going to offer it to you free, no charge. And we were like, what? Why would he do that? We, we couldn't believe it. We thought there was some kind of catch. And he did. And um, he didn't even, okay. he was like. I'll got, I've got to give you at least a hundred bucks or something. He's like, just pay for my gas and probably maybe $80 or something. And he tried to knock that down to 20 and he was like, Nope, you've got to at least take 40. So, you know, yeah. basically we got to, yeah. we got a new car for $40. If you want to, it's not even, I, I said, it's not even $40. That was more delivery fee, if anything, because yeah. they drove all the way from Georgia to here to bring it to us. And, um, it just has problems with the battery right now. And, Oh, there's an oil leak. Um, but, you know, any money we put into it to correct these things yeah, is just to correct it. I mean, we haven't sunk any money into the vehicle itself, yeah. and uh, it gets us from A to B. I've had people on my Facebook question me, like, what condition is it in, and how is it, and be careful. And I've had people write me saying, like, you know, if it's not in good condition, and it's like, oh. It's like, who cares if it's not in good condition? It's free. No. Who Who's going to say, this vehicle's not perfect, uh, but it's free. I'm not going to take it. And no. especially if you're in the position we are, where we need a vehicle, we are not going to turn it down. I mean, who who would do that? That's just dumb. The guy was completely honest with us, told Man, us all the nice problems. Guy. Yeah. Um, he didn't try to say it was perfect. He said it's, you know, yeah, it's he got told a, us right away what was wrong with it. It's got a rebuilt engine and the engine is strong. It's strong, it's fast. Yeah, it, it is good. It just, um, yeah, they, a few minor problems. One could be a major problem, the, the whole battery thing, but that's not really a big deal. But couldn't you just replace the battery Yeah. and correct it maybe? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it charges up, you know, you put a battery charger on or whatever, you jump it and it's fine. Um, but again, it gets us from A to B. It's a vehicle and it was free. So you can't ask for better than that. And that, that kind of thing just doesn't happen to you every day. I mean, it doesn't happen. So every, month. <laughs> every, every year. year yeah. <laughs> so we're just like, whoa. Yeah, I'm still like, whoa. Yeah. It's aggravating sometimes when it won't start, but it's, it's an easy fix. I mean, you know. I, I'm glad we didn't pay money for it. I will say that. It's yeah. pretty rough. I'm glad we didn't buy it. I'd be in a bad mood if we did. Yeah. But um, it is still a very selfless and kind thing because yeah. he had the price that he wanted for it actually written on the back still. And he was asking three grand for it. $3,000. Yeah. So 3000 to 700 to 500 to free. So. Yeah. That's pretty amazing. Wow. <laughs> um, anything else? Mm-hmm.
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, what? Okay. Uh, so most, I think the stuff that I ordered for the contest has come in. Oh yeah, he got his R finally. <laughs> so we got the J and the R. <laughs> Woohoo. No. Um, and I got this as well, which is pretty cool. This keeps flipping around, but, uh, that's really pretty but uh so i've got the stuff for the contest in there's been quite a number of entries which is pretty cool um i had mentioned that i had a couple of other necklaces that i hadn't seen in person yet so i didn't want to offer them so i've gotten two of them here so if i have another giveaway i might add these to it if i can still find them and if people are interested so this is the brain one that goes with the rib one i was wearing you quite like the brain one huh yeah it's got the little, you know, thingy. It's pretty solid, really well made. It's kind of heavy. Too. Yeah, it's kind of heavy. It's pretty adorable. And this, like one, this one, yeah, this one I just got. <clears throat> and this is a uh, big, <laughs> and it's quite three D. Stands out. It's hollow in the back. It says that AVP. AVP, and it's pretty well made as well. It is quite nice and so i had this on in a couple pictures that's what it looked like this is even like a boy necklace nah. oops oops your boy put the boy necklace on <laughs> yeah so. it's just hard because it flips around sometimes because yeah. it's big but it is pretty eye-catching i quite like it and i have an alien one that i'm waiting for to come in that hasn't come in yet but if people are interested in these and if i have another giveaway i might include two new ones of these um so yeah i think that's about it my videos are few and far in between now like we're as, make more though. yeah well i had warned we weren't gonna make many because um we don't have internet at the moment i'm just using my data for everything and we're just enjoying spending time together and stuff and stuff and i'd mentioned on facebook about your job that's a big thing right now for you know stress and also it's letting us spend a lot of time together um you want to explain what happened uh some guy he came in and bought our rouse and he just started firing people i don't really know what happened but... probably he had his own people come in yeah yeah um fired like what like what would you say like 12 people or something yeah. fired like half the staff mm -hmm. people that have been there for years and um so he's been looking for work and without having a job, it's really stressful. And I, I have been running into issues getting my ID card here, my license. So I've actually got like no identification except for my social. And they're just really giving me a hard time because I've been out of the country so long. So I can't really do much. I've still, I've been looking for like work online kind of stuff, work from home. Cause I still have like a New Zealand license. Um, that's not valid in the states but an international kind of online thing would probably take it um but those are all usually scams or they want you to pay first oh, and I, i'm not looking to do anything like that so um we've just been kind of stressed mm. about that but also it's given us like crazy time together so we've yeah. been staying up to like it's 3 40 a.m right now we've been staying up till about six in the morning watching supernatural like all day long <laughs> all day all night I have been applying to jobs and all this. I'm getting, I've gotten a few callbacks. I'm, you applied for what, like 20, 30 jobs already? 20, yeah, it's 20 something. 20 something, yeah. So, um, but at nighttime, that's in the daytime. At nighttime, we're just supernatural all yeah. night long. And um, before he lost his job, we bought a PlayStation 2 and oh, some cool. games. And so we've got like Tekken and um, Soul Calibur, Under the Skin, Bombastic. And Kingdom Hearts. You can get my Xbox One over here. Play. And I'll, yeah. I'll kick his ass a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> I'll keep you posted on that. <laughs> You'll be over there like, well, she beat me. Yeah. No. <laughs> but um, looking forward to that. We're just waiting for uh, cords to come in and for him to get his TV. 
from his mom's house and the memory cards to come in and everything else is here. Stop it. And uh, then they'll give us something else to do together, which is pretty cool. And that's about it, I guess. We do want to make more videos together, but it just seems like the day just goes. Mm. You know, we're watching, we're watching. Next thing you know, it's like daylight and like, oh shit, we should have made a video today. Because I know everybody wants to see the, the couples challenge videos. And so we're kind of thinking about those. Does that hurt? I don't want to hurt you. <laughs> All right, I guess that's it. You got anything to say? You look tired. And uh, not just happy Valentine's Day to everybody. And uh, hope it went well. Hope you got what you wanted. You got who you wanted. And who you wanted. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we'll see you next time, I guess. I got who I want. Me too. Yep, I guess that's it. I wanted this to be like five minutes long so I could yeah. upload it. <laughs> it ended up being almost 20 minutes, but I haven't had a video in like fucking two, three weeks or some shit, so I guess it's all right. I guess it evens out. Yeah. We'll do more. We'll do the challenges and all that stuff. So Yeah. We'll do the, we'll do the whisper <laughs> challenge for sure. I guess we'll try one where he tries to put makeup on me. Maybe if you think you're good enough. I think you'd probably do pretty good because you watch me do my makeup quite often. Yeah. I think that one would end up boring because you'd probably ace it. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, I don't know what else what else we could do. I couldn't do like the chubby bunny one because I'd probably choke. Yeah, me too. Oh, you know that one? Yeah. <laughs> we'll figure something out. Yeah. There's the the um <laughs> the boyfriend tag or whatever boyfriend girlfriend tag the couples tag where you answer questions about each other but i think oh, yeah. we know each other pretty well so i think we probably ace those as well and uh the challenge ones when you ace them they get kind of boring i guess people want to see people fuck up <coughs> yeah. but yeah i guess that's all yeah. for the fifth time yeah. you see how easy it is to say bye and then you keep talking that's why yeah. i always did it yeah <laughs> All right, we just passed our eight months together too. Did we? Yes, we did. October, no wait, <clears throat> June. Yeah, we just passed eight months together last week or a couple of days ago. Yep. So that's cool. It was fast. Yeah. We're almost at a year. Almost. We're four months away, and we're supposed to get married in four months. How the fuck are we gonna manage that? We will. We'll see. No, wait, not four months. We changed it to my birthday. Oh, yeah. So it's um seven months. No. <laughs> yeah, seven months away. Seven months we're going to get married. I don't know. Once I have my ID card, I don't know if I can wait that long, though. Yeah. We'll hmm. figure something out. Yeah. We'll figure it out. Mm -hmm. Like we always do. Mm -hmm. Love. Love you too. Alright, I'm gonna shut this off now. Alright. <laughs>